what an intriguing title of a program, Friendly Visitor. Tell us about it. Well, it couldn't be more literal, really. I consider myself a bit of a matchmaker on a platonic sense, where there are so many people in Montgomery County who just have fascinating lives but are now homebound, sure. either due to some kind of physical disability or aging, and so many people in Montgomery County who might be willing to learn a bit and about that person's life and make a new friend. Well, how do we have these un, uh, these lonely people? We're a, we're, a, we're an area of a million people. People have come from all around the world. They're here. They fought the government. They worked for the government. Businesses around. Why should we have any lonely people? Well, this is down? exactly the problem because people have lived all over the world. I recently assessed a family that was in the military, and they had literally lived all over the world in Europe, in Scandinavia, all over. And of course, their friendships. Are scattered, we're, we're, are we're scattered and are in we're Europe, fleeting. or and their children, who are successful adults, are living on the West Coast. So the adult is left alone, and these okay. people have many of them have families. And now, before days, before I we before we go on, I just want to make sure there's a phone number you came with, and yes. I know you're going to be volunteers have got to be a big part of this. But before we get into that, and, and we get to Mariana's question first. What's the telephone number? 301-424-0656, and I'm at extension 507. Okay, I'm sorry, Mariana. No, what I was gonna say with, with the way also people are today, and community-wise, there's not as much interaction. It's all, right. you know, internet, and all that kind right. of stuff. Absolutely. So it's easy to be isolated. It's very, very easy, easy to be isolated. And, and often the relationships that we have with our neighbors is on a more superficial level. Yeah. And they don't necessarily have time to sit. There's a woman, for example, I met in Germantown who's absolutely lovely and her neighbors come to walk her dog daily. Right. But she tells me that they don't actually sit and talk. talk about life. And they and must have so much history. Exactly. So much the people in our county for the most part have done such interesting jobs, State right. Department or you know other high-level government jobs or even just in sales and have seen the county change over the last, you know, if you, if you can, right. I have clients who are eight, 100 years old and remember everything from when they were children and, and it's just fascinating, fascinating. Do you yes. have